Hi, this is Heidi Caswell here, WordPress 101 for Boomers. And we're talking about using images on your website and where to find images. Now you can take pictures with your photo and upload them with your camera and upload them. Digital cameras are great for this. You can create something using some type of graphic program. Uh, you can search online, find some type of stock photo. Um, you can, in most of the stock photo places, you they pay you a fee for use of their images. Um, some people like to go to some place like Google or Bing and search for images here. This is like the search for apple blossom and you can find, if you just need the picture of apple blossoms, you'd have no problem finding many images over there on Google. The problem with just searching for images is you don't necessarily have permission to use it. And just because you don't see a copyright picture up there, that doesn't mean you can't. Um, it doesn't mean that you have permission to use it. An easy way to make sure that the um, images you pick up are you're free and have permission to use would be to go to Flickr. And then on Flickr, you can search. I'd use the advanced search button. And over there, you can see towards this bottom, the Creative Commons. And you want to search just within the Creative Commons. And these are people that are giving you permission to use that. Now, as they give you permission, most of them want you to give them credit. So as you post the picture, you're going to have to say who the picture was, who, who made that picture, who gets credit for it. And that way people know, no, no, this is not my image. I didn't make this. This is one that so-and-so made. And if your site is one that makes money, you want to search among the sections used commercially. If you want to take this image and you're going to want to alter it and change it and add more graphics to it, then you check that button too. I'm going to go ahead and hit the search button here. And here you can see we have many different apple blossom pictures. And you can do this with any search term that you're wanting to use as you're looking for um, an image to use. Maybe we had one you're talking about spring and apple blossoms. And you wanted a picture of an apple blossom there. Just find one that you like. Find a good one in there under, using the Creative Commons. And if you go up here to Actions, you can see that you have different sizes that you can use here. And you just may want to go find the size that's going to fit right for your site. That might be, I use 640 for a lot when I have one going up across the top. If I want a smaller image on the side, this would work fine here. But you can see the different sizes. Maybe you're wanting a square version of it or something. But you can see these all showing up. And some of them would just be huge, huger than your would really want to put on your site because uh, they take a while to upload. Like this one there that's large but smaller. Um, once you find the size that you're wanting to use, you can download it. And you can see one just downloaded there. You just check this button here and it will download them. I have some right reserved and this, what they're wanting is uh, you must uh, give them um, credit for making it. And this one, this particular one, is they you can't alter the work. You can't change it to something else. Some will let you do it and some will not. So if I was to use this image on my site and it just downloaded it here, I would go ahead and, you know, you'd upload that picture that you had onto your site. And then on the picture or down at the bottom of your post, uh, somewhere you can have where it's visible that this photo is by, and then whoever it is that you got it from will go on Flickr. A lot of times I'll even have a, click, a link back to the Flickr site there. And that gives that person credit and acknowledges that yes, this is their work. And this is a much better way to get images for your site if you're not creating your own or using a stock photo place. Um, hope you enjoyed.